negotiation uh, process, which always occurs at the end, end of every session, uh, we did feel at times as though the goalposts were moving. Uh, and, you know, this system depends on people uh, being good for their word, keeping their word, and when they make a deal, having it stick. And for some reason, it, it, things were, and I don't think it was even bad intent. It was just people were under stress, and so the ordinary negotiation process did not work as well as it should be because the goalposts kept changing. I mean, you saw it today with the tobacco tax. The tobacco tax changed back and forth probably five times, and um, I was overjoyed that its last change led to a successful vote. But normally speaking, you know, those deals are, are, are cut at a you know, particular time and they stick, and, and that didn't happen this time. But despite all that, we ended up with some amazing uh, outcomes. What was the deal for the tobacco tax that they agreed to suspend the rules? Or? Oh, it varied, and, and at the end, they just agreed. They just For nothing? Uh, they, they, well. I, I don't, the, it was a moving target for days with me, target. and I'm not going to go into the different things, and next, it just, because I never stopped pushing, that was very important to me personally, because I, if it passes, I, the, the you know, that isn't, if you look at just the tax, you can write your argument, but if that passes, Oregon's commitment to mental health in terms of a dedicated fund <coughs> will be per capita like no other in the nation, and you cannot talk about, we're going to do something about mental health unless you do something about mental health. So that is an extraordinary accomplishment if it will pass and where that money will be dedicated. So, you know, I was surprised because I was, we were just a few bills away from going home when we were there and I was ready for it. I had to let go of the cigarette tax about, I'd say six hours ago and it really broke my heart. I kept fighting and fighting and then I met with Herman this morning and he said no and he said no thereafter and there was different things but uh, uh, I, I, I really don't quite know what happened in that caucus to, to make them make a move because they're like, when they went in that last caucus, uh, 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 something happened and they came out and they gave us the green light. And uh, sadly, you know, Herman went home and I need to call him because he, you know, I think being a caucus leader is the toughest job in the building. And uh, but I don't know quite what happened in there because we didn't have any deal when they, when we didn't say you know anything because that had fallen away. We had we had we were back and forth and negotiations. There someday the audit there could be an extraordinary book done on the, the negotiations done in this session on all kinds of things. So I can't answer your question.